Well, I guess it's on to episode three. I do want to mess around here briefly in the- Savalord! <laughs> like, what the fuck did you just say? I want to screw around here a bit in the post-game. I hope you appreciate all I had to do to get you back on the throne. You bet I do, and to show my appreciation, I'll let you have the job back. Yeah, you already tried that. Is there anything new in here? No, okay. I'm wondering if we can go outside the castle again. No. We're missing one of the flags. That's the thing. And I was hoping I'd be able to find where that flag is. So we've got Strongbadia, Country, Pom Pomerania, Constetia Stand, the Bleak House, uh, whatever the hell Marzipan's place was, and the Homestar Reservation, so... Or Homestar Reservation, so what is that? Is it like... Is there something here I cannot... No more sitting on that thing! I'm starting to get... Like the sh oh, now I remember what that thing reminds me of! Charles Darwin! Evolution guy and inventor of the fish skeleton, apparently! Okay, we're going back. a great addition to my team, Girl Squad. You never forget. Apparently we have Darwin now to use with the Team Girl Squad cards. Which I was not expecting. So we're gonna go make another comic. I hope you appreciate Yeah. Yeah, you yeah, yeah, yeah. Stupid bear. What if I set the No, I already tried to set the bear on fire. That looks better. Where am I gonna get another... Okay, let's go to Marzastar. Or Marzastan, or whatever the... If that's an end, then I'm just an idiot. What are you doing here, Homestar? I thought you and Marzapinhead broke up. She said she'd take me back if I figure out how to get rid of this stupid draft wheel. Okay, well, let's take Tony Stoney. The display? What are you doing here? She's a Okay, Strongman's still here. As War is over, Strongman. You can go home now. Refugee! <laughs> no, really, Strongman. <laughs> you can go back home. Support the war, Valorans! Ugh. He'll find his way back home eventually. That's what I'm imagining, is that they won't survive the... Uh, War's the, over, uh, Coach Z. You can go back home selection. now. Yeah, I should go back to that musty gym. Instead of out here in a nice garden, behind Marzipan's house, where I can watch her. Always. Congratulations, Coach. I just spent the last few hours carrying my brother's internal organs in a jar, and you still managed to top that on the creepy scale. Okay, um... Yeah, let's go to the Homesar Reservation. Or Homesar. A giant trunk filled with- Okay, well, we don't want that. I wonder if the ancient wisdom of the Homesars is now lost to us forever. I'll take the last bus to the bank sale. Yeah, maybe we're better off not knowing. Oh, I'm sorry. Okay. Let's go play with the cave paintings. More Stone Age action! Cave Girl Squad! Cheerleader! Do it so! What's your face? The ugly one! <laughs> Color Cave Girl! Beans. And yeah, I'm gonna skip through this because I've watched it like multiple times by now. Um, what happens if I use. Okay. I'm trying to remember what. Okay, if I use this. Everybody come check out the cutie! And then you get. Stop. Stampeded oh. by the mammoth. <laughs> Hi, cave girls. I'm Charles Darwin. Hiya, Chuck D. Wanna drag me around by my hair? You need to evolve more. You need to natural selection more. You need to E equals MC squared more. 
The floodplain mall is open for business! Let's hang out in the food court for the next epic! Word! Written word! Okay, I'm gonna... Well, actually, I actually want to see what the aliens Greetings, is. humans! We come from space space to teach you how to build pyramids! Dead, 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 <laughs> So artistic and boring! <laughs> okay, we're gonna reset that. Okay, so I'm thinking tar pits and... We'll use the tar pits. In the mammoth on this one. When it's all gonna show up for our date? Feels like I've been waiting for years. Thirty-eight thousand years, actually. Dreadfully boring, that. Wonderfully preserved for future research. Well, bully, bully for you. <laughs> Everybody, come check out the cutieolithic mammoth dress I scored. Stampede. Gore. <laughs> the flood okay. Were written. So you were I talking wish about somebody run this sheet of blank clay. Dear Og. Dear. Let's do snakes. Ow, my iconic rep. <laughs> One hundred. I got. Okay, so I'm gonna go with aliens now. Greetings, humans. We come from space space to teach you how to build pyramids. Way ahead of you, Mr. Spaceman. Whatevs. Guess you don't need this cancer cure either. <laughs> Laters. <laughs> A new ribbon. I want you making braids like I got on spring break. Is that a m m mummy? Marty, we've been embalming pharaohs for 30 years. You gonna freak out every time? Brain out the nose with the hook. My sinuses are so clear. <laughs> <laughs> it's over. Hmm, not bad, but it's still nothing for the vandalized history books. 18 points. Hey, I got points! I got fucking points for once. Hey, girl squad! Chill it! What's a fuck? Okay. Color beans! And eat some more pigs, boy! And I. Okay, so we're gonna do Everybody. this. We're gonna do this. Yes. <laughs> And then I'm gonna use Charles, yes, try using Charles Darwin here. Rip. Hi, cave girls. Hi, it's in it, squad. I mean, Charles Darwin's funny, but it's not like ha ha funny. Oh, this jump. Since it's <laughs> one hundred. Okay. Great heads. I am uh, right, the newbies. Newbies, you. It's over. Ah, uh, something that unfunny should stay buried. All right, the yeah. secret Dean girls, of course. All right, okay. Charles Darwin does not seem hey, to be particularly girls, useful. Girls, Unless that Darwin is like useful again on like dog. just one of them or something. Hi, cave. Hiya, Chuck. It's squ- Okay, hey, so- Hey, girls! Chip! 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 Okay.
I'm perfectly round, stealing boys to take me to. Everybody, come check out. Stop. <laughs> I feel like that wheel is for the something. Blood 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 what? Hmm. Whoa, take it easy. Where's the rest? Come on. A <laughs> <laughs> oh, wolf puppy! One hundred. Good. Okay, what happens if we use Darwin in this episode? I came. Or epoch. You need to squat. Yeah, Darwin doesn't seem to do hey. much other than just uh, like. What? Show up and be like, oh, no, no, no. And it's a more pig boy, and I got all. <sighs> okay. So, we'll... everybody, come check out the. Let's get you trampled. <sighs> the alien, I want to stick around for the par pyramids. I think Sabertooth oh, Tiger is now a good summer. time to, because that's like an appropriate <laughs> time period. Red. And then... Where's Red? Appease. <laughs> Cross. Ah, Red McGrath, I didn't want you. <laughs> okay, then give you the... Chisel? I with that. One hundred million thousand. I got good boy. Okay, then give you. Yeah. Oh, dear. Yeah. Yeah. So that doesn't make any sense. It's over. Hmm. Not bad, but it's still nothing for the vandalized history book. Okay. So what I did that was good. I just shouldn't have used. And in some more And I got all. Maybe? See, Darwin doesn't seem to do anything, and I need to use both of these to do something. So that's why I'm thinking Mammoth... I'm thinking Mammoth, followed by Sabertooth Cat... Followed by... Uh, Domesticated wolf, followed by gunshots. Unless I can figure out something to combine the wolf. Oh wait, 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 wait. I bet you if I combine the wolf with Darwin. It's over. Ah, something. This team. Okay, I'm gonna. I know what I'm gonna do. I'm going to. Reset. And just see what happens if I use the wolf right after. Or the Darwin right after I use the wolf. That yeah, didn't seem to do anything. What? Okay, so then let's do Mammoth. <laughs> then Cat. <laughs> then the Gun. I'm thinking. Unless I can use this now, and then use that Whoa, like that. Dang it. Where's red? And then the ribbon will already be used for when we get here. I got me. Get back to work. On hmm. I thought that that ribbon stayed on their heads. Maybe it only stays on some of their heads. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe I can use Darwin and then the wolf, actually. Let's try that. 
Fly. Yep. That's not what Hey Collins It's my boy and I got Okay. Everybody Mammoth Cat <laughs> oh. Sense <laughs> That's not Strong Bad what? seems to want to make it as funny as possible. And I think one of the things is that I don't have all of the I don't have all of the uh, the ones that you can find. So I think the thing is the one I can find is the one that I'm supposed to be using here in before I use the gun. Because nothing else here seems to really make sense. A perfectly round swing boy. Whoa, take it! Where's Red? A P. <laughs> Cross. I ground it, aren't you? <laughs> okay, because then we can use the alien here. Greetings, humans. And then use the ribbon. A new ribbon? I want you making braids like... And then they think she's a mummy. My son! <laughs> okay. It's over! Ugh, something that unfunny should... No, nope. I, 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 I don't care that much. I mean, really, at this point, we're just goofing around. So, uh, I'm ready to move on to episode three. What was that? Bronk? Why was there a bronk noise? Is that just the... That was not that. What the hell made a bronk noise? All right. We're going to close the menu. We're going to quit this. We're gonna save our game first. And, uh, go on to episode three. So, because I'm an idiot, I didn't save a shortcut to episode three in my quick links. So I had to move some stuff around. Give me one sec. And let's start. What is it? Like the baddest of the bands or the battlest of the bands? I think that's what it's called. The baddest of the bands. Okay. What am I? Why am I making brains? I'm not making brains. Are you ready to new game? Oh yeah. Um, there's an hour left today. I All might right, so I might actually play machine. a bit longer than that. Let's though. See what you got for me today. But an hour guarantee. Oh, dang, it's Limousine's Hot Babely and Odyssey, loosely based on the life and times of the coolest rock band in the world, Limousine. I, like I said, okay, I might play Babelians, a bit longer. Get ready to be rescued and romanced by my rock what and roll rulers. Control for tractor beam. Okay, I see, I see. Hey, what was that? No. Please. Uh-oh. No, no, no! No! Come on, man! Don't do this to me! Ah! Go on, get! Scram! Oh, crap cakes! Not well, again! Hey, bats. I just sprayed three cans of 4WDD in the cartridge slot this morning! Looks like I'll have to take it to the only fully licensed vid electrician in town. Bubs. 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 Don't worry, my poor broken fun machine. Bubs will fix you up better than new. All right, the Tarantula Black Metal Detector. Now with built-in shovel attachment. So I'm assuming the shovel attachment's just going to be standard for the rest of it. That's a teaser poster for the off-delayed cinematic classic to be. Dangerous 3, The Criminal Projective. By the way, the third episode of the game is... Our fourth episode is Dangerous Time 3. for a little bit of randomly violent Teen Girl Squad fun. What the crap? Where'd all my notebook paper go? How can I draw any new episodes without any loose leaf? The TV seems so lonely without the fun machine. Come on, pile. I know you got some change in there. I'd even take 
Canadian coins at this point. Hey! Oh man, not even a single Our money's loony. not worth as much. I used to hide Strong Sad's retainer in the seven track all the time, so it still felt like part of the team. Alright, let's go down to the basement first, just because we're down here. Water successfully wasted. Okay. <laughs> Last month, Strong Sad sat me down and explained the ins and outs of the washing machine to me. The dry -er, however, remains as enigmatic as ever. Dry -er. Cool! A marathon of those depressing rockumentaries. Uh oh, they did the inverted negative photo thing. Somebody's going to rehab. Hey, this rockumentary is about that band Big Knife. No way! The lead singer's name isn't really Rip Knife? I feel so used! I haven't checked the couch cushions for change, chips, or charred remains recently. What's this? Nothing says, I have no business wearing these like leopard print pants. I may have to oil myself up just to fit in them at the photo booth. <laughs> All right, have a have a good one, KJ. Uh, hope you're feeling better. I know you're feeling kind of shitty, so thanks for coming and hanging out in your while well, wallowing in sickness. So thank you. Have a good sleep. Have a good sleep. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. I know how to use the photo booth at, by this point. Once those replacement parts clear customs, I'll be back to burninating peasants in the comfort of my basement the way the good Lord Trogdor intended. Okay, let's go back upstairs. Go through the living room. Okay, we can use the Luxa Lounger. Mm, again something's time. wedged in the Luxa Lounger. Whoa! Oh man, it's a limousine shot glass featuring high kicking Larry Palaroncini! So I'm assuming that was just a collectible. Because I don't see it there. Ooh, gotta start a fresh map since the King of Town inhaled my old one. Let's find a place for Bob's place. Okay, so there's limousine mini glasses. Okay, I can't interact with the smoke detector. Oh, the sh on the shot glass was it? I didn't even notice. Oh man, it's a limousine shot glass featuring high kicking Larry Palaroncini. I mean, like, there's something really weird going on with that oh, angle man. there. It's a limousine shot glass featuring high. Microwave we can interact with again. So clearly you're supposed to go over there, Strong Dad. Jeez! Ah, and think someone balled up a bunch of forks and stuck them in there yesterday. <laughs> hey, the, the mayonnaise is gone. Sweet! A can of Wallapino flavored aerosol cheese! Easily one of my top five foamy orange food products ever. Okay, so we've got Wallapino. Aerosol cheese. We keep the rotting corpse of Charlemagne around in the hopes that he'll one day rise from the grave. Okay, let's go in and check our emails. Wait, what? Oh, there's our lighter. I must have left my lighter here during last night's candlelight spemales after dark session. Hmm. When I say E, you say mail. E, mail. E, mail. Hey, we only have one email in the inbox. Yo, S to the B. I'm trying to come up with a good name for my band, but it seems like all the good ones are taken. Any ideas? No name brand band. That's true, Brandy. All the good ones are taken. 
That's why you need to start thinking of futuristic band names. Like My Personal Jetpack, or The Robot Rebellion, ooh, ooh, or Really, Really, Really Tiny Cell Phone. That should be enough to get you started. But I'm gonna need my royalties in the year 2086 dollars. Or Globnars, as they will then be called. Thanks, SB. No, that's darn bad. You didn't predict the future properly. It's all about the big cell phones now. They gotta be this size. He says as he turns his phone on by accident. They, they, they went from this size to this size, and this was big for this size. But now they explode as well, so... Deleted! <laughs> That's where I keep all my defunct computer games. Most of them won't even run on the lappy anymore without, okay, so like, it'll, turning it'll off come back the around by then. hitting it with the brick. Alright, I got it. Looks like today's the day I take my fun machine to Bubs for some emergency repairs. Time for a brave switch. And now it's time for a breakdown. <laughs> Ah, uh, that's the stuff. Well, there's all the paper. Strongside ordered this bookshelf from one of them designy, foreign, put-it-together-yourself catalogs. This little guy is called Flergendrool. What's that? That's my Totalmatic Sudden Shot camera. It's so obsolete that it actually uses a mysterious substance known as film to make pictures. Whoa, exotic. Can I borrow it? No way, strong bad. <laughs> Stop grabbing at my stuff. I want to look at the stuff on the table, but it won't let me interact with it. Also, West is lip. I can't seem to interact with strong sad. Hey there, Sister oh, there Christian. Go. Remarkably, I don't have time for you today, strong bad. No idea, I'd never heard of it. You don't know anything about a bat infestation, do you, Count Succula? Ah, I see you've met the Von Blaubloods. The Von Hua? The Von Blaubloods. A rich lineage of fruit bats I'm raising in my bat hutch. I don't care how cool their last name is. Tell them to stay out of my room. Why are you raising bats? Aren't bat hutches supposed to be out of doors? Or in of Marzipan's bed? Normally, but the Von Blaubloods love the delicate mixture of dank and damp here in my room. I don't know how to tell you this, but someone broke the fun machine! Someone? Yeah, I think it was someone Jackson, or maybe someone Jackson Jr. Can you fix it? No, but Bubs has a black belt in fixing outdated electronics. But well, Bubs will probably make me pay for it. With money. I also accept firstborn children. <laughs> Are you sure you can't fix the fun machine? All signs point to leave me alone and go to Bubs. I'm sure I'll instantly regret asking this, but, uh, what you doing? I've finally decided to pursue my dream of becoming a snooty rock and roll journalist. A rock and roll journal? <laughs> you won't be bwaha haing after I've sold the poignant coming of age tale of my snooty exploits to a snooty independent movie studio. You're right. I, I shouldn't. <laughs> what movie are they referencing? I'm trying to remember. It's a movie from like the. I forget. What are you doing I can't again? Remember the, almost I'm famous. I'm preparing That's to set they're... sail on my dream of becoming a snooty rock and roll <laughs> journalist. I need to put the subtitles on for us. Well, the... let's fix that. Let's turn the hints up and turn the subtitles. There's the bat hutch. Hollering Jimmy's bat hutch kit. Since when do you keep bats in your room? Not just any bats. The Von Blaubloods are an extended family of majestic fruit bats. They inspire me. To what? Get rabies? Can I borrow your awesome bat hutch? I, uh, 
want to do that thing with the tinfoil that screws up their sonar. You leave the Von Blaubloods alone. Okay, okay, jeez. Don't foam at the mouth. What did you win? Welcome to Mildew City. Please, fasten your gag reflex. Oh, there's the LARPing sword again. Hey, how'd you get your fake dress-up sword out of Bum Pomerania? Or Club Techno Chocolate? That, my friend, is a tale fraught with intrigue, drama, and mild adventure. It all started Yeah, yeah, stop talking. Can I borrow it? No. Can I just take it anyway? Come on, let me borrow your wussy role-playing sword. Not for all the golden peasantry. Uh... Why, hello, Gorgius. It's a miracle the toilet is still functioning after the workout the King of Town gave it last month. I love having multiple monitors so much. Like, it's one of those things that once I had it, I could never go back, really. Hey, little man. Where's my pick? What's new in your monosyllabic world? Cool types. Oh, band practice, huh? Have you kicked Marzipan out yet? She brings snacks! Fair enough. I forget, who else is in Marzipan's band? The cheat on skins! Man, why does Marzipan get to hog all my bros? Why can't you start one of those lame core bands with strong sat instead? Now, don't freak out, big fella. But I got some bad news about the fun machine. Fun machine, okay? Not exactly. See, there's been an accident and... Make better! Must play Lady Snake Parade! Okay, okay, I'll make the fun machine better. Man. Lady Snake Parade! Just to be sure, what would you do if the fun machine were broken? Smash stuff! Break stuff! That's what I thought. Yeah, I initially started out on just my laptop, and I found it very frustrating, to be honest, um, for streaming. And I basically started using my iPad and to connect to IRC, because, like, Twitch, that's, that's what Twitch is on the back end. So I would connect to the chat channel on my iPad and use my iPad to keep an eye on chat. So, like, I had to basically go to using a second monitor without having a second monitor. Did you know that Strong Sat is raising bats with a cool last name in his room? Save the bats! La la la! Are uh, you like him too? Did you know that Strong Sat? Okay, we already know that. Uh, you... Well, did. Okay. Come on in here. Man, that painting is creepy. What the hell? Come on in here! This is Belinda, Strongman's favorite dumbbell. She's a bit on the heavy side, but she has a great personality. Strongman plays a heavy bass. Literally. The strings are actually those cables they use to hold up bridges. Oh, there's an old record over here. Whoa! There's something I haven't seen in, like, forever! Strong Sad cried for days when I defaced this record into the most awesome album cover idea ever! I bet you could sell, like, a kajillion records if you put together an album cover like this! So do we have that in our inventory now? Okay, so we have a defaced album. This is where my brother keeps all his extra singlets, gym socks, and athletical supporting devices. There's nothing, like, on the other side. Okay, I was gonna say, just make sure there's nothing... Okay, uh, I guess we're going downstairs and going to Bubs. Although, I guess we should go outside and use the, uh, the metal detector again. Oh, no. Rock out. Yeah! Intriguing. Okay. Box peering guy. Hey, 
Whoa! It's a shot glass with generically tall limousine bass player Perry Palaroncini. I think this little patch of ground is already horked up its share of treasure. Okay, so there's nothing here. Not some new here. Not some new here. Check out my squealing Larry limos. Yeah! Whoa, I sound awesome. I bet I could make all kinds of cardboard boxes materialize out of thin air with this thing. I'm just saying. Band practice in marzipans is always good for a little heckling. Where should I put her house? Let's put her house over here. First, let's go see Bubs. Why does Bubs have a golden record? Or a diamond plated record? Watch this jobby here, Bubs. That's my diamond encrusted plantanium record I got back in the day for selling a bajillion records. Oh, from your days with the duo duo. Don't you say that name, old. About this gold spray painted record. I don't want to talk about it. Hey, what's this? Some kind of old contest entry form? Win a rip roaring rock devu with Limousine's album cover design contest. If you've got a photo that you think is tough enough, simply scribble your name and address on the back, slap on a stamp, and send it to blah 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 blah. If your photo is chosen, you get to spend a whole day with Limousine for your rip roaring rock devu. Whoa, an entire day with Limousine at my call and back. That would be so tremendously awesome that it kind of hurts my brain and I maybe need some aspirin. So I'm assuming now when you use the defaced album. Man, younger me was a genius. If I can take a photo that looks like this crude drawing, I'm a cinch to win that limousine contest. <laughs> so we need someone to sit on the car, set it on fire. We need strong, sad sword. I don't know where we're going to get a dinosaur. <laughs> What's the deal with this win a day with limousine contest? I should I know. Sometimes I just pin random stuff on my wall to make it look pretty. Bubs, you gotta help me. It's my fun machine. It's broken. It is? Well, we can fix that no problem. Oh, good. I was afraid that that'll be one big sack of cash. One big sack of what? One big sack of cash. This is gonna be a tricky job. I gotta order some parts, hire some skilled labor, go back to night school, <laughs> maybe take some tap lessons. How am I gonna get a big sack of cash? You could get a job. I sure could use an apprentice grime taster. No, there has to be a more convoluted way. But how? Rock and roll so bad! That's it! I'll put on a battle royale of the bands and use the profits to fix my fun machine. I know all about putting on concerts, Strong Bad. I'll even help you out. You will? Sure, I love little side projects. I'm knitting a winter vest with my feet right now. See? Terrifying. So, who should I get for my <laughs> battle royale of the bands? Slow down there, Strong Band. Before you start signing up any acts, you're gonna need two things. Security and celebrity judges. Okay, so that's how we get the celebrity judges. Without celebrity judges, no one's gonna bother to come see the kind of fourth-rate acts that'll pay to be in a contest. And without someone running security, who'll monitor the line to the cold one stand? The mist tent? The porta potties Who the crap wants that job? I don't know, man, but while you were staring at my feet, I made you this deluxe security jacket. Get some poor sap to wear this thing and find me some celebrity judges. That will be an illegitimate business. Okay. This must be what Bubs used to make that lame security jacket. Let me hear you, come on! Well, that was quick. 
Wait, there's a star over there now. Oh, but we hmm, need a star, don't we? from the last Duo Duo concert before their unfortunate breakup. Why is the flag at half mast? The strong body of flag is flying at half mast until the fun machine returns to full mast. What the crap? Someone's been vandalizing strong body as precious natural resources. Something tells me I haven't sucked this place dry of useful items. At least not yet. Strong belly up. Pop. Okay, let's try yelling into the microphone again. Well, all right! Uh... Well, here's the car. Why is there oil here? Hmm, that oil slick is new. Maybe it also has smoke screen and missiles. So I'm assuming I can set it on fire with the lighter. Now, what was it Strong said told me about cleaning oil spills? Um, set it on fire. Thanks, big little brother. I never said that. Too late. Okay, not too shabby, but it's still not quite jumping out at me and tearing out my jugular. Because this is sustainable, right? Here's the photo booth. Oh. I can't wait to strut down Hollywood Boulevard in this pair of Hollywood Boulevards. I gotta try these on at the yeah, well, I don't really... Like, the photo booth is a neat I idea. I this little patch of grass. I just... I don't really find it interesting to do anything with at all. Yeah! Like, it's like, yeah, that's neat. Cool. Let's see what sort of gibberish the old drive through whale is spouting today. I'm a pretty girl. Well, that was unexpected. Yeah, it just feels like filler. Backing out may result in severe liver damage. We hope you enjoyed your life. Come again. Welcome to Barbaros. In the event of a firestorm, the salad bar will remain open. Woohoo! If you're dissatisfied with our service, please accept our invitation to bite me. Please smile for the Barbaros satellite camera. What the? Thank you. So it looks like that's there's the star. Bob's doesn't need this light dead star. Why does he waste the money on advertising when he's the only game in town? And he's right over there. Eat at Bob's. Jugga, jugga, jow! I assume it was. It was fairly loud for me. It's the stick. Keep on sticking it out. Ooh. 
Lots of cool bands have posed in front of this wall over the years. Lots of cool midget bands. Yeah! Whoa. There we go. Box peering guy. Hey! All right, a headband. I can use this to keep sweat from streaming in a booth. Yeah, just more photo booth stuff. I'm just like, I, I... Hello, Pittsburgh! Hello, Pittsburgh! I've reached maximum caritude. Jugga jugga jow! Sweetle now! But in my mind, it's always like, well, if he keeps them occupied and away from my shit, they can mess with as many boxes as they want. One fish, two fish, starfish, carfish. Okay, that's two parts. I think I like you, glowy starfish. You do not make me want to barfish. Okay. What else do we need for this thing? I bet you could sell like a kajillion records. I have still no idea what we're gonna get the dinosaur. Like this. I'm assuming we need to get the sword from. Oops, not main menu. Why am I going to? The derp is strong with this one. All right, let's go to Marzipans. For my money, nothing calms the jangled nerves like screwing with Marzipan Zen Garden. For my money, no carefully arranging this rock in my pants will enhance my overall serenity. Okay, so we can't go to Marzipan's backyard anymore. Oh, we got new emails. There's my hey, pants hey, answering hey, machine. Hey, hey, my span. This is Wade. My name is Wade. Just wanted to say how psyched we are to have you guys evolve with Bad Aid this year. Uh, anyways, just hoping I could score some kind of promo photo of the band, you know, to put up at the local herbal coffee, you can, uh, nutritional food book. Like, do you mean like store, which one is on the left and which one's yoga, on the right? Because you can change that in windows and stuff. Anyways, be well, sameling. Like, uh, that's pretty easy to do. Like, it's a drag and drop thing in your, like, screen settings. Hey, teenage lobotomy! Don't bother me, Strong Bear. I've got snooty rock journalism to pursue. How'd Marzipan get two kind of cool guys like Strong Matt and the Cheat in her band anyway? She lets them each write one song per album. Ah, that would explain a lot. How'd Marzipan get two kind of cool guys? Nope, yeah, it's just ah. repeating. Check out this article of clothing. What is it? It's a security jacket. You know, the kind worn by security guards at concerts. Oh, I can't stand those guys. They're always laughing at my press pass. So, about that... Yes? It's not really a security jacket. It's actually a tour jacket for the obscure new indie band called Security. Security? I've heard people talking about them. A lot of people. See? They're hot! But talk is cheap. Legit indie bands have street teams that use guerrilla marketing tactics to get their name and logo up all over the place. Okay. So I have to use... I need to find some, find some paint to put the security logo up somewhere. Hey, I got a story for you, Mr. Snooty Rock Journalist. Prepare ye all butts for maximum kickage as Strong Bad organizes a legendary battle royale of the bands! No, you're not. No, really. It'll have security and celebrity judges and everything. And ponies? Yeah, and ponies. Wait, hey. Woohoo. 
Wait, Strong Sad's making fun hey, of I us? I got a story for you, Mr. Skinizer. No. No. What kind of alternate yeah. universe is this yeah, where Strong I, Sad's making fun of us? What drags you out to Cool Tapes practice? I'm covering the Cool Tapes preparations for their next gig, a benefit concert for the vegan albino bat. Wow, slow music news day, huh? I'm also keeping my ears open for chatter about any hot new acts. The Cool Tapes have lots of connections in the underground music scene. Interesting. What drags you out to Cool Okay. I'm also ground music. Well, okay. Marzipan always keeps your kitchen boarded up when Strong Mad's around. Also, what is... Yikes, that is one oh, pathetic that's a bat. looking okay. bat. For your information, Strong Mad, that is Pasquil, an endangered and precious Lithuanian albino vegan bat. So, I'm going to quickly travel back to the host, hoping that Strong Sad is still here. And go upstairs and try to take his sword. And his camera, to be a, a, to be honest, I'd like to just take all of his shit. There, there's his camera. With the totalmatic sudden shot at my side, I'll totally be able to shoot all sorts of automatic pictures. Suddenly. Okay, take the sword. Not sure which is duller, my brother or his padded safety sword. Let's call it a tie. And I'm assuming Strong Mad is also not here. But I don't think there's anything in here I want. Come on. What you want to Man, that. What if I use the left closet door? Ah, the dinosaur! Ah, the mighty Pudonkis. His natural camouflage made him virtually invisible to predators in his native environment, which was, apparently, a clown's house. <laughs> Okay, right, um, let's go to the car quickly and drop these things off. We just need someone sitting on the car right now. Through the magic of forced perspective, the unsuspecting automobile is threatened by the long thought extinct giant Pudonkis! Arr! If I want a sword on my album cover, I'm going to need a hot blonde to be holding. Or at least, a blonde. Oh god, am I going to have to find, like, a blonde wig to wear? Because Marzipan's not... Is Marzipan blonde? I can't remember if Marzipan's blonde. Let's go... Let's go see. Also, wait. Before we do anything, let's scream into the mic. Yeah! Well, let's stop there. There's a blonde rig in there. Now this is cool. A limousine shot glass of Gary Palleroncini demonstrating the hardest chord ever. In the dressing room? Which dressing room? Yeah, let's... I need Mars Marzipan! Take five, everyone. What is it, Strong Bad? What are you guys practicing for? The Cool Tapes have been invited to perform at a concert to benefit the endangered Lithuanian albino vegan bat. Like poor Pazquel over there. Nick, yuck! Oh, right, right, right. Stay on cool! Right. Yo! I do remember that Bring one. it down! What now? What are you guys practicing? Okay. The Queller. Yeah. What's Strong Sad doing lurking around here? He thinks he's some kind of a snooty rock journalist now. I am not. Well, I'll let. Goodbye. Yeah, I know. I thought the same thing when I saw hey, it. Hey, Marzipan. What? Could you hold this for me? Why? I'm working on this album cover, and I need a hot blonde to pose in a bikini with a giant sword on top of a flaming car. And even though you really aren't all that hot... Uh... So, you'll think about it? 
Lucky for me, Marzipan's not the only blonde in town. The cheat is blonde. Man, you gotta stop wasting your time with Marzipan and join a real band. A three album deal with guaranteed four point back end? Ding dang, maybe I should join the cool tapes. Maybe you should stop interrupting our rehearsals. Calm down, Marzipan. Hey, to cheat, I've got a great idea. Mm -hmm. I need a hot blonde to hold this sword for the greatest album cover ever. And you're the closest thing available. Mm -hmm. I knew I could count on you to cheat. I'll see you later at the shoot. Don't forget to wear a bikini. What's the wide, big guy? You can talk to him <laughs> after rehearsal, strong man. I often. <laughs> okay. Okay, that's that's dealt with. This window is usually where I steal fresh pies from Marzipan. Okay, so we need to go back to the car. Tasteful cheat. Tasteful. Okay, I'm feeling lucky about this one. Let's see now. Dinosaur, check. Burning car, check. Imploding star, check. Hot blonde with a sword, check. Looks like we're ready to make some album cover history. Hey, to cheat, why don't you give us a good scream? Something that says, terrified, determined, and, oh, my loincloth. <laughs> Whoa, this is great. I better take this before I lose the light or something. Man, did I choose the right lens or what? This is like <laughs> the coolest album cover ever. I better send this off to Limousine before its coolness freezes a hole through my pants. Okay, so I'm guessing then I put it in the mailbox. And of course the car stays on fire. The make automobile is looking especially fearsome today. Of course. Okay, let's do this thing. We're in a day with limousine contest. Staten Island. One, oh, three, oh, one. Limousine album immortality? Here I come. Dear Mr. Bat, are you ready to rock harder than anyone in your pimply male teenage peer group has ever rocked? Because your bodacious album cover is the winner of the Rip Roar and Rock Devoo with Limousine Contest. Just let us know when and where, and we'll be there, ready to sock your rocks off. Keep on seeing limousine. All right. Okay. Part one complete. I love that we're doing all of this to simply fix the video game. Um. Let's. I know we got more emails. emails. Dear Strongman, in your opinion, what era of rock rocked the hardest? Looking for validation, Mark Darren! Sorry, Mark, I don't validate. Maybe check with pubs. But I can tell you exactly when rock rocked the hardest. When you're 18 to 24 years old. But if you're over 24, man, sucks to be you. Because music rocks less and less with each passing year. Until the next thing you know, you're listening to the oldie station and playing air guitar at a stoplight next to a car full of teenagers that spit and laugh at you. Stupid kids. They call that noise music. Curmudgeoningly. Strong bad. Yeah, I think it was a mistake in the first episode for them for them to not have Strong Bad answer the emails. Because that makes it so much better. Wait, can I take the bats? I should take the bats. Putting bat hutches in my pants. Hope I don't get bit. <laughs> Stupid British dudes that I thought were ugly British chicks. 
Strong Strongside ordered this bookshelf from one of them designy Flurgan drew. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was hoping I could take the papers off the table and go make a Teen Girl Squad comic, but apparently not. Um, okay. Maybe I just have spray paint already. Huh? Like, maybe Strong Bad just has... Oh, I've got the aerosol cheese! I bet you that's exactly what I have to use. This seems like a good place for a stencil. Now that's a spicy bit of graffiti! Excuse me, is this the fabled fence where all the hipsters vandalize public property with the names of their favorite bands? Why, yes. Yes, it is. Oh, good. I'm a snooty rock journalist looking for the next big thing to be pretentious about. Do tell. Security. Hmm. <laughs> So, about that jacket I showed you. Yes. It's not really a tour jacket. It's just an You can't fool me. Huh? You don't think I'm cool enough to be a fan of that cool new security band that everyone's talking and vandalizing about. Uh, yeah. That's it exactly. Where'd you get that jacket? I have to have one. Yeah, good luck with that. These babies were snatched up by all the hipsters weeks ago. Oh... I guess I could let you borrow mine for a while. Really? As long as you promise not to get any failure on it. I promise I won't fail you. Hip Indy Credville, here I come. How do I look? Like a guy who's totally tapped into today's underground music scene. I'm gonna show this off to everybody. Yeah, you do that. Hey, security guy! Is that what they call fans of security? Interesting. Well, hello yourself, security guy. No, dummy. That's what I call dummies who've signed up to run security at Strong Bad's Battle of the Bands. Oh, but... You're wearing my security jacket, ain't you? Yes, but... So take this billy club and get securitizing. Okay... Well, I have no musical moments, but like decent project or progress on everything else. Okay, Bubs. Bubs, strong man. How's the shit? All right, so we got that. How's Strong Side working out his head of concert security? He's great. Really? No, but the kid sure looks good and yellow. Bubs, I found some celebrity judges for the Battle of the Bands. Who that? Oh, just a little small time band called Limousine. Limousine? I'll make millions selling hairspray and scarves. Well, now that you've gotten some celebrity judges and duped that poor marshmallow boy into running security, it's time to start signing up some acts. Some acts. That's a great idea. Here are the entry forms. I'd say entry fees from three bands would be enough to cover your video game repairs. <laughs> three it is. Let me just put on my invisible concert promoter hat. Nice one, Steven. There we go. Nice Time to one. sign up some crappy bands. And I'll get started building some stages. So, Bubs, got any hot tips on cool bands? Well, there's the cool tapes over at Mazapan's, pom-poms over at the club. Hey, didn't you and Coach Z used to be in a band? <laughs> Coach Z, don't talk <laughs> to, to me get about Coach that Z and big Bubs back together. Sound.